I'd rather be broke, broken in a research month, but in tip top out. I, 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 I really, if, if they say, if God came down from the heaven right now and say, I have a proposition. I'm going to strip you of everything. But I'm going to give you good health. Or I can give you everything. But you're going to be battling different, you know, animals. Strip me of everything, Lord. Strip me of everything. I will, look, I will get it again. I will start over. Lord, strip me of everything. Hey, you guys, what's up? So a lot of my um, subscribers not going to know what I'm talking about, but um, there are some who will, okay? So when I heard that she passed away yesterday, it was just so sad. Um, you know, just seeing that she did a video a couple of hours prior to her passing away. You know, I've been rocking with her for a couple of years. She funny to me, older lady. She kind of gave off the auntie vibe. She always playing the oldies. You know, just give you that motherly feeling. And she be spitting wisdom out here, giving us wisdom here and there. And I've listened to her, you know, a lot. I really don't feel anything when it comes to someone passing that I don't personally know on YouTube. But with her, it was like sad. It was it hurt, it hurt my heart to hear that she had passed away. It was so sudden. It was like, I don't know. It was it was different. Right. I felt bad I kept thinking about her kids, you know, because she talked about her kids. And I was thinking about her dogs because she had dogs that she spoiled like they were human beings she always had her granddaughter i think her granddaughter was like 10 young you know on her shit always dressed up and stuff um getting on here clowning you know uh roasting motherfuckers she was funny as hell right so when i heard that she passed away i was so i was i always going to in her chat you know and talk to her that way and I rocked with her. I, re I really did. This is from a whole nother sector that I've been following for um, a couple of years. So, you know, you get to know somebody. Uh, and certain people might not even know that you care about them to a certain extent. Um, you know, and then when something tragic like this happens, unfortunately, they don't know, you know, because it's too late to kind of share that with them. But, you know, that's how I felt about her, right? And she probably wouldn't even think, like, what? Healing within? Like, out of all people? She probably thought, it just, hey, that's healing within in the chat. You know, girl, we'll, we'll be going back and forth. She wouldn't have probably thought that I would have felt so sad to the point where I almost cried when I heard about it, thinking about her passing um, yesterday, right? So now they're coming out saying that she faked her death, right? Now... From listening to Boom Boom Room for all these years, that alone, and I don't know her personally, right? Just what what I got from her. That alone is not her character to even go along with no shit like that. I just can't believe that. it would have. I would be shocked, way more shocked than I even was finding out that she passed away. If it comes out that she faked her death, that would be even way more shocking than hearing about her suddenly passing away from a heart attack okay remember i talked about the jaguar ride you know and the thing in the mental illness and um you know with this whole jaguar ride and this girl fakely a daughter talking about that's her and all this shit right just to, just lingering this shit on knowing damn well that's not Aaliyah and r kelly fucking daughter you know and the girl seemed like she got mental issues as well right Here's another situation where I find myself trying to understand or grasp what is wrong with somebody to even think that someone would do something like that. And what is wrong with someone who would do something like like what 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 is going on in the head of us? like what is wrong with us? What is wrong with us? 
Now, why, what, what would she benefit from lying about her passing away? They not asking for no donations. It's a barrier. No one's coming out saying, hey, you can send if you want to donate anything, you could donate it to this. We're not asking you to donate it. But, you know, if you want to, then feel free to, you know, she's going to have a beautiful funeral regardless. No one's asking for money at all. What would be the purpose of her? She had YouTube pages before. She just shut it down and start another YouTube page when she feel like getting back on here. When she said deuces to YouTube, she tied of this sector and, and, and the shit she was going through with the different bloggers she would just leave what is the extent why would she go to great lengths to say you know what um let me just fake my death let me tell everybody gonna tell that i passed away and stuff i just want people to feel sorry for me and stuff see i want to look in these comments and see who cared about me and stuff and yeah well i'm um actually didn't pass away i'm actually they said she was actually at the club last night um and they got video of her at the club so she just did this for some motherfucking sympathy. Hmm? She don't ever ask nobody for no money. She do. She send pe give people money. Well, I've seen her give more things than than people giving her anything. So what will be the purpose of her doing that? Did you did people who saying that she faked her death? Did you do some thorough research and look into it? Other than you know, did you actually fact check? certain things before you come out here to say that she uh is lying and she didn't pass away other than oh they said that she was at the club last night and oh here go this picture of her oh um other than that what else so the niece who wrote on her community wall i'm sorry to say the lady that y'all call boo boom has passed away i can't stop crying this is what her niece did you know and some pictures of her and stuff so she did that she lied she in on the lie too the the, the, the niece or or what so y'all gonna say that denise probably act like that was the knee the niece who wrote that but it was actually denise who wrote it hmm what would be her purpose of doing i don't i don't understand that at all i don't i don't understand that and i had lost my point but hopefully it'll come back I keep running my motherfucking mouth. There was a point that I wanted to make in that, but I forgot y'all. Yeah, I'm trying to do too many things at one time right now, okay? But when I listen to this, and they saying that she faked her death, I'm like, that don't sound like something that she would do. There's not. There's not like she's the type of person that came out here and have been just lying and we've been catching her in lies and she been she just don't she she's always been a genuine type of person. Now, if this comes back that she actually did do this, you know, then that would be yeah, I would say I would, yeah, I, I Everything that I thought about her or felt about her or how I see her would just be going down the motherfucking track. You know, it really would. I would want to watch her ass more just to be looking at her like, damn, you really that motherfucking crazy, uh, Miss Denise? Her name was Miss Denise. Just to look at her, just to look and, just, you know, like you see a monster or some shit. You just looking at the, to know someone is capable of doing something psychotic and, 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 mental like this you just look at them like what is going on in their head you just want to look at them and shit like they yeah like something wrong with their ass what what is the point what is the point she was she didn't take no shit from nobody so it's not like she running from somebody or she's scared the last damn video she did a couple of hours before she passed was um uh, waiting outside of that goddamn ross telling the motherfucker to come outside and catch them hands Mm -hmm. So it's not like she's scared and she's trying to duck and dodge from a fight or she need to, how I'm going to do this, I need to get out of this. And it's not like she's scary to be doing it. So why would she do this? Why would someone put a video out saying that she is, I mean, that she faked her death when you don't have enough proof to prove that she did fake her death? Then on the flip side of it, they'll say, well, how you know she died? Now, who the F just goes around here talking about that they passed like that? Like, just with her alone, that just doesn't sound like her. I don't feel like, I don't think that she would do some stupid ass shit like that. 
But what would be the purpose? I don't understand. That's what I want to know. I, I had to get that out. I'm driving and I'm listening to this shit like, what? Hmm? How do they know that? Like, why? You know what? When I say, you know what, y'all know I done came to. Yeah, mom. I'm pretty much like, you know what, I'm at my wit's end with this, this shit. I don't know what else the fuck to say. Uh, yeah. My mind can't, you know, comprehend this stupid ass shit. Um, yeah, this shit is, is, is crazy. It's crazy if she faked her death, and it's crazy for a motherfucker to think that she faked her death. Yeah. Yeah, you ain't gonna get up out of this. Mm-hmm. So it's on both. It's on both sides of this. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Then to just get out after 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 we you know they said that she passed away and what happened, um, and even gave reasons as to why she passed away, right? People came out with videos to contribute it to her, right? So, but why would you do all that and then come out and and just be and just be bold enough to just be like? Wow, Miss Denise. Wow, boom, boom, room. Really? You lied? You faked your death, Miss Denise? Huh? You didn't feel... You wasn't kind of skeptical? Like, let me just hold out a minute, you know, before I hurry up with this video talking about she faked her death. You you just wanted to just... You, you believed that she faked her death that much right after you gave her some condolences, right? and a contrib- tribute a whole video to her so then you just right away just with those two little proofs or you know, i didn't see no video with her in it i seen the video but i didn't see her in it and it could have been an old video you know it could have been an old video could have been an old picture you know she go out all the time. I remember she would get out and she would get online and she'd be like, I'm about to go out with my friends, you know, my best friend. She would show off what she got on. She was always dressing, okay? Her ass stayed dressed. She dressed more than my ass. And I'm old enough to be her daughter. I'm like, damn, she damn near got my ass beat when it comes to this fashion shit. She stayed dressed. She stayed going out having fun and stuff. So she always went out and shit. But why would someone say this? Like, I don't understand that. Now I'm like, what is going... Like, mm. All right, y'all. I don't even know what the fuck to say anymore. Miss Denise, R.I.P. You know, R.I.P. I can hear her now, like, these, she would have been talking shit if this was somebody else. Like, why was that? She would have got out here, like, why would they even say some stupid ass shit like that? Like, if it was someone, I can hear her ass now doing a video, like, I got to say something, y'all. I tried to be quiet, but I got to say something. And getting out here, like, why would they, like, <laughs> mm. even when she gone and she passed away, they still on here with this motherfucking shenanigans and shit. Mm-mm-mm. What would be her reason? What would be her reason to fake her motherfucking death? Hmm. Somebody was after her or something? Huh? What? What's the reason? What is the reason? Did they check her Facebook page? Did they read the comments? Until you gone. I mean, don't y'all got her Facebook page? I don't know her Facebook. Anybody saying condolences on her Facebook page? Have anybody tried to look that up? What are people saying? So if they saying condolences, she calling everybody in the family talking about, hey, act like I'm dead and go on there and write RIP so everybody can think on YouTube that I'm dead. She give a fuck that much to care that some YouTube people would think that she dead, that she just make this shit up. See? I'm about to start going. I'm about, I'm about to I'm about to be on the road with this y'all. I'm, I'm, let me go on and stop right now, okay? All right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. See, I tried to think things out. I tried to play things out. I tried to, yeah, to say, okay, well, what about this? Well, what about that? Okay, well, no, what about this? So you think they'll do that, huh? I don't just be narrow-minded. I tried to look at everything to say, okay, well, wait a minute. Hold the fuck up. Okay? Mm-hmm. All right, y'all. Y'all, whoever know about this story or whatever, comment. Tell me what you think.
Okay? If you think that she faked it, tell me why you think she faked it. If you don't think she faked it, put the RIP in there and tell me what you think about the people who think she faked it. Okay? With that being said, I always end with, y'all be careful out here because these motherfuckers is crazy, y'all. They real crazy, y'all. Now y'all see why I always end with that, huh? Mm -hmm. I'm going to keep reminding you and telling you why I always end with that. Because look, here's the proof. The proof is in the pudding right here. All right, y'all. So y'all have a good day. All right, bye.